Hello everybody, my name is Macaron Teacup Baby and welcome to a tutorial on how to convert Shining Nikki to Miku Miku Dance. Now before I begin this tutorial, this is very important everyone. This tutorial is for Windows PC computer only. Meaning you cannot do this on your phone, you cannot do this on your tablet. Now you can download Shiny Nikki on your phone and tablet and plug it into your computer and work like that. But the way I do it's a little bit different. Um, I'm going to show you the steps right now. So the first thing you need to do is download these programs. Um, the first one is BandyZip or actually you can use any sort of zip extractor like WinRAR, 7-Zip, something like that. I just prefer BandyZip. It's my favorite. That's my go-to. The next thing you need to download is the XAPK of Shiny Nikki, which I will provide links in the description for everything. Next you want to download Asset Studio. And this next one is actually two options, either Blender or Metasequoia. For this tutorial, I'll be using Meta Sequoia, but if you have Blender, then by all means use Blender. I don't know much about Blender, so I cannot help you with Blender. So I do apologize ahead of time for that, but you can use Blender. BGM Toolbox. And finally, PMX Editor. This is the version I use. And let's get started. So first thing you want to do is you want to, um, like I said, download all of these programs and open up the folder location of your XAPK file and this does take a while to download so if you're downloading this then I would suggest if you have a slow connection like I do I would suggest making lunch or dinner or something maybe a cup of tea while you're at it because this does take a while to download especially if you have a slow connection like I do so you're gonna open up the uh where you put the XAPK file and you're going to right click Actually, before you do that, if you do not see .xapk or dot .any other extension, like let's say, um, let's go to my pictures real quick. Okay, see how that has a PNG? If you do not see that, go to View, File Name Extensions, make sure that is checked. So you see the extension. So now you're going to right click, rename, and put the extension as dot, oops, not comma, dot zip, or yeah, dot zip, push yes. It's gonna ask if you wanna change it, say yes. And again, that will get rid of the file extension name, so make sure this is checked. Now you're going to right click, extra, actually I'm gonna make a new folder actually before I do anything else. I'm gonna call it Shiny Nikki. And I'm going to extract it to the Shiny Nikki folder. And if I do that, I right click on it. Extract to another folder. You can also extract here or extract to blah 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 blah. I'm going to extract to another folder. And I'm going to extract to the Shiny Nikki. Push OK. And this will take a minute. Um, because it's a kind of a big file. <laughs> so I'm probably going to uh, stop the video. Or at least cut the video until it's all done, which it's almost done. I can just continue talking to you guys. So how is everyone today? Really? You did that? Oh my god. Oh, okay, um, now that it's 99, there we go. That's all done. We're going to open the folder. Double click this folder. Android, you want Android. OBB. games. This folder. And this is a um, .obb file. You're going to right-click, rename, and after .obb, you're going to put .zip. Yes. And you're going to extract it here, and this one will actually take a while. Because, like I said, it's a big file. So I'm probably going to cut this video and be back soon. Okay, so that took two minutes to do. <laughs> Literally took two minutes. It was, um... I started about 4 minutes and 30 seconds, it's 6 minutes, 27 seconds, took 2 minutes to do. Now before you open this folder, I would suggest opening VGM Toolbox, the exe file. Click on Miscellaneous Tools, Extraction Tools, Generic, and Byte Remover. The start address should be 0 and the length should be 8, so make sure that's set all settled and you're gonna X off the folder right now. You're going to go to, um, back to the Shiny Nikki folder that had the OBB. Click on Assets, Art, Character, Prefabs, Cloth, 
and control A and drag that in there and it will start doing its thing. This is the easy way of doing this guys, the easy way of doing this. And next to what you want to do is you want to go back to character and go to textures, cloth, control A, drag that those bad boys in there. And we wait for a minute. It's the same thing too, just leave all that default or zero and length eight. Then go back to textures and then go to body and let's find the hair hair. You want all of the hair. So down to about, mm, about right here. You're gonna drag that in there as well. And you're done. You're done VGM tool box. VGM toolbox. Open up a set studio twice. You want to open up once, twice. You want two windows open. And I'm gonna teach you guys how to do accessories right now. And then I'm I'm gonna do a hair one for you guys as well. So in the first asset studio, you're going to file load folder, and you're going to find the asset folder art. Character, prefabs, cloth, and then select folder. And for this one, file, load folder, and we're going to load the textures, the cloth textures. Select folder. And you're going to, um, on this right here. Not this one, obviously, this one, the one that you opened the, uh, the, um, meshes. You're going to go to the asset list, filter type, mesh. My phone is like right there. I'm gonna put it right there. And uh, you're going. Oh my gosh, what happened? I think it closed on me. What? Why did it close on me? What the heck? What the heck, my voice? Okay, I'm gonna try that again. Um, Asset Studio. Let's double click on that. File, load folder. This one, this one, this one. Select folder. There we go. Okay, asset list, filter type, mesh. Okay. And here are all the meshes. I'm not sure why it closed. I mean, maybe because it's weird. I don't know. So I'm gonna find an accessory that looks like a delicious cake, but I don't want the cake. I want an accessory. I think it's down here somewhere. Where's the one I want? Where is the one I want? This one right here. Yes, this is the one. The kitty purse. It's so cute. And there's two parts to this. There's this part and this part. And to tell and to know it's um the serial number. P A B A zero a lot of zero five. And there's two of them. So you want to go ahead and click on one, control click on the other one, right click, export selected assets. And we're going to go back to the Nikki, um, the main Nikki folder, Mickey DMMD, which is what I call the folder. Select folder. And it should make a new folder. Excuse me. Um, uh, filter type, texture 2D. And same thing, we're going to find the serial number. So that was, what was that one? I forget. P-A-B-A-0, love 05. So P-A-B-A. With the 0 and 5, or 6. This one also has um, a 6 at the end of it. I remember that. Um, it depends on what color you want, Mace, basically. So I want this color, actually. So I'm going to right-click, export selected assets. Select the folder, and that's the same folder we were in. And this one, I do like to move the texture to the main folder. And delete this folder. Not the folder with the OBJ files. You want to keep those. Now we're going to open up either Blender or Metasequoia. Which of course I'm using Metasequoia. So, um... I know that. File. Open. And open up the... OBJ. And, um, you can actually delete the geo, not the geo with the zero on it, but delete the first ge geo. Geo with zero is the actual mesh. File, insert, this one, okay, yes. Hang on, puppy. 
delete that one. And I'm actually going to move this up. And now we're going to apply the texture. It's right here. And oh my gosh, that is such a cute purse. I want one in real life. It's a kitty purse. Look at a little bell. Look at a little kitty bell. I know, Bizu. It's so cute like you. Now for Meta Sequoia, you go to File, Save As. And you save it to PMD. Oh, I know, puppy. I know. And I'm going to make a new folder. Call it... Nikki stuff. I'm gonna call this purse one and make sure you multiply it by 13. Push OK. Yay, it is so cute. And I'm actually going to move the texture into Nikki, Nikki stuff as well. This is the same folder. You can, you can put this folder on your desktop. I know, puppy. You're as cute like you. And no, puppy. I know, I know, I know. No, but a PMX editor. My dog, my dog is barking. I'm so sorry. I'm gonna pause this. 